Ever wondered how to create stunning AI animation films or story-based videos with minimal effort? Imagine generating short 10-second clips from simple text and images and seamlessly combining them into a captivating video. All this is possible with just one AI tool, no complex installations or integrations required. Before we dive in, make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss out on the latest updates. So, without further delay, let's get started. Morph Studio is a groundbreaking AI tool that lets you create complete story-based videos effortlessly. Whether you want animation, cinematic, cyberpunk, fantasy, nature, pixel, or realistic videos, this tool can do it all. And the best part? It's completely free to use, at least for now. All you have to do is join the waitlist by clicking the button. After a few days, you'll receive an email with a link to sign up for your account. Once you've signed up, you'll be directed to a simple and clean dashboard, ready to start creating amazing videos. Click on this Create button to start using this tool. First, set a name for your project. Now choose any of the aspect ratios from this list and click on this Create button. You will be directed to this page. By clicking on these three dots, you can give your scene a name and description. You can upload anything such as audio, images, and videos related to your project. By clicking on this icon, you can add more shots based on your story. With this option, you can upload up to 10 images at once to generate the videos. We will discuss it later on. Let's start with the text to video generation first. Let's start with a basic prompt by typing a text. Click on this option to choose the filters. Here you have four different models for video generation. You can check this comparison table for each model setting. We will cover all these models in a couple of minutes. Let's choose this text to video model. We have multiple camera options to choose from, but the issue is we can only choose one option at a time. Let's choose this camera zoom in option. Here you can choose the duration of videos up to 10 seconds. Let's go with the 5 second duration. You can also control the motion strength. I will go with the default options. Once done with the settings, click on this button and wait for a couple of minutes. This process will take a little bit of time, depending on the load on the server. So, our video is generated. Let's check the result. This generation looks good based on our prompt. Here you can see the resolution of this video. If you forget to type the video style in the prompt, don't worry. You can choose any of the style references from this list. Let's choose this anime style. Wait for the generation to complete. And here we have the result with the anime style. You can regenerate or use this reprompt option for another variation of the video. Let's try this text to video option again. This time, I will generate a character based video. Let's type the character name and description. And click on this Save button. Let's type the text prompt. Choose the Camera Control option. This time, I will choose the 10 second video duration with default motion strength. Click on this button to generate the video. Here we have the final result. You can see that the dress of this girl changes as she moves. Also, there is a little bit of disturbance in the background as well. There might be issues with the longer durations, but overall it looks good. Let's choose the style reference to anime. 
and wait for the process to complete. Here we have the result. This video looks amazing irrespective of minor issues with it. These can be resolved by using a detailed prompt. Let's talk about the main feature of this tool, combining these clips to generate a complete video. Just join this dot with this clip and the last one with this export option. Wait for a couple of minutes. And here you can see the 15 second clip. Click on this export button to download the full video or separate clips. You can also add background music by clicking on this option and uploading a sound clip from your computer. Before moving to the image to video generation, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more upcoming videos about this tool. First of all, create a new project by clicking on this create button. Give this project a name and choose the aspect ratio and click on the Create button. Here you can upload a single image or go with this Bulk Image Upload option. Let's start with this Bulk Image Upload option. Here I will upload four random images. Click on this button and wait for the process to complete. So, our images are uploaded. Let's arrange them one by one. So, our images are arranged based on each scene. Let's start with the first image. Here we have two different models for image to video. First, I will go with this default model from Morph Studio. Let's choose this camera zoom in option. Choose a video duration of 5 seconds. This time, I will increase the motion strength to 8. Now click on this button to generate the video. Here we have the final result. The video looks a little bit fast in motion. Let's change the motion strength to 6. Also, I will paste the text prompt. Now click on this button and wait for the process to complete. Here we have the result. The video still looks a little bit morphy. Let's change the style reference to 3D animation. This video looks good, but is not perfect. You can generate better results by tweaking the options. Let's try this stable video diffusion model. Choose a video duration of 5 seconds. And click on this button to generate the video. Here we have the output. Irrespective of this little issue with the feet, overall, this video looks great in terms of background and character motion. You can use this motion brush tool to select any area to give the motion with this pen tool. Here I have selected this area. Let's type the text prompt to check whether it improves the motion or not. Change the model to this one. Choose the camera control to zoom out. Set the video duration to 5 seconds and motion strength to default. Click on this button and wait for the process to complete. Here, we have the result. The main character does not have any type of motion. This may be due to the motion brush we have selected, but you can see the background motion. Let's clear the motion brush option and click on this button to generate the video again. Still, we have the issues with the bottom part. Let's move on to the next scene. Apply the camera control to zoom in. Choose the video duration to 10 seconds with the default motion strength. Click on this button and wait for the process to complete. I will apply the same settings to this last scene as well. Here we have the results. For this video, the background animation is fine, 
while the character is still struggling. The same case with this video as well. Here we have results after applying the text prompts. Still, the character is struggling with the motion. As a last step, let's unite all the clips together to make a complete video. This process is simple and straightforward. Just join those clips that have good animation by clicking on these dots. Once done with the combined process, wait for some time. Here we have a complete video. So, now you can generate complete AI films with this tool for free. In my upcoming videos, I'll share a step-by-step -step guide to creating story-based videos. This includes not just animations, but various other categories as well. Make sure to like and share this video. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. See you soon with more exciting stuff.